All right, good morning, good morning. A little rough transition there. Hey, Ray, how you doing? Didn't think you was going to make it, but uh, hey, do apologize. I got a little late start than uh, what I was planning on. Took me a little bit longer to get ready this morning. Um, and I'm going to have to cut this one a little bit short, so we'll only be able to stream here for about an hour. Uh, just uh, never played this game before. A lot of uh, people have... Uh, played this and a lot of people know all about it and all about the series and I have no clue other than uh, just kind of word of, of friends of friends of friends who have played so obviously it's a survival horror game we'll just jump right in Resident Evil Let's see, display, we'll, we'll try to keep everything original here, I guess. Wide or original? Hmm, maybe we'll leave that where it is. Controls alternate. Oh, maybe it's maybe it's original for the controllers. Okay, so maybe we'll just go ahead and, and uh, leave everything the way it is. How do you like your games? Like climbing a mountain? Fulfilling but takes a lot of work? Like going on a hike? Good exercise but not too strenuous. Like taking a walk? You can relax and enjoy yourself. Yeah, let's take a hike. Alright, so... I've seen a couple people play these over the years. I don't, again, I don't know the full storyline and everything other than, uh, you know, it's kind of a, um, I think like a, a big pharma making a biotech type uh, uh, weapon or something, uh, which kind of gets released, turns into some kind of mass uh, hysteria. Uh, people uh, become zombies. Then you try to right the wrongs i don't know beyond that i really don't know so let's just jump into the story we'll see how it goes i don't know what these up arrows are for oh okay so i think this might be a newer this might be the original version of this guy and this might be a remastered or newer version of the guy okay well we'll stay with the original and then what is this Oh, this is the lady. Let's see how she looks and changes. Oh, okay. Kind of change around there. Let's let's uh, play as Chris Redfield. And how do I go? There we go. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Chris, found it yet? No, not yet, Brad. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. <laughs> Do what? Some message got deleted. That was kind of strange. Oh. Sorry about that, Ray. I don't know what it's doing. <sighs> I 
Uh oh. Wow, those guys look pretty ugly. Y'all need to run! Hey, Brad. hey, hey! hey. He Chopper's leaving us! Whoa! Chris, this way! So, a newer there game only three stars would have had now. you play in part of that uh, Oscar, intro Bill screen. And myself. We don't know where Barry is. That's the difference of the last 15 years. Is everyone all right? Barry. Where's Barry? He's... No. What was that? I'll go and check it out. <laughs> All right. I'll, I'll have to change that on Streamlabs or something. <laughs> Chris. Oh man, we got to do emojis in the uh, care. in the chat. Yeah, that's the best part about it. Yeah, just a reminder: I have not played this game before, so I'm probably gonna screw it up, make some mistakes that people remember from 15 years ago like dude why don't you know this and I'm like I don't know <laughs> alright why is this why is my why why do I have a cursor here it's like kinda in the way feels like can I grab this An ink ribbon for a typewriter. Will you take the ink ribbon? Yeah, we could probably... Oh, hey, there's a typewriter. Wow. This is a different way of looking. Or, you know, I guess, obviously, it's... Uh, uh, what we do now is different from this. <laughs> I got a knife in my hand. That fireplace looks really good. I'm liking the look of this room here. Alright, am I supposed to do something with this typewriter? Probably. Oh, you haven't seen it all. I like the sounds of this uh, grandfather clock. The picture there. Man, for uh, what, 15 years ago? And this game was in development. Um, let's back up the bus here a little bit. Um, originally this was also called Biohazard in Japan, but, um, it was started out, like, back in the 80s, I think, um, let's see, yeah, back in 1989 it was originally called Sweet Home. Alright, am I supposed to do something here with this ink ribbon? It's an old typewriter. Alright. Oh, you can save your progress. Oh, okay. Alright, alright. So we're supposed to save our progress at the typewriter. Okay. Alright, how do I get out of this? Use the ink ribbon. Nah, not right now. We'll wait. Alright, how do I... There we go. 
That was a little odd. I thought with my mouse cursor here I should be able to move that over, but I actually had to use the uh, w, WDs to uh, move the cursor over. Alright, so which direction are we going? Are we going this way? That gunfire. I'm counting on you to investigate, Chris. You got it, Wesker. Oh, do I gotta go back in that room? Was I not supposed to go out that way? Yeah, this is kind of weird how um, each scene kind of opens up those doors. Which, I would say, you know, probably for uh, 15 years ago was, you know, a nice way to do a scene transition. This still looks pretty darn good, actually. Can I go out this way? It's a different style of door here. I like the light here, man. I like the wallpaper. It really gives you a good feeling of a, a old creepy mansion. And I like how it's um I like how it uh the, the, the camera angles. It's like you're watching a movie. Let's see if we can go in this door. Huh, it's locked. An emblem of armor is carved into the lock. Alright, we'll remember that. Memorize that. Am I supposed to go this way? Oh, it's that old school elevator, man. Do we go up the elevator? It's got creepy ass music. We're like, whoa, ho! Oh, there was like uh, some stairs there. If I go down. Am I going down the basement? Oh man, this is like, this is some creepy stuff here. It's locked. Everything's locked. An emblem of a sword is carved into the lock. Alright, cool, cool. So, there's going to be different emblems that tell us uh, from the key which door it opens, I guess. That's pretty cool. I like the look of this game, man. This is, like, really cool. Why didn't I play this, like, when I was a kid? Man. Probably because I was old <laughs> when this game came out. I wasn't a kid. Alright, let's see if there's another door down this hallway before we take the... Yeah, so when it does a scene transition, then I'm like going the wrong direction. So I actually have to stop and restart. Does this go back into that um, entry um, dining area? the door there. It's locked from the other side. Alright, so this one right here was the uh, dining room thing where we first kind of came in. This one had an emblem of something. So can't really go there. So I guess we're taking the elevator. Going, whoops, whoa. Alright. Going up. There's an elevator here. Are you serious? So, we can't go downstairs. We can't go through the other door. The other one, the third door is locked. Where are we going, man? Alright. Could take us the whole hour just to figure out how to get here. Alright, so if I go this way it won't let me. And then if I go, alright 
Okay, so that's I'm trying to figure out where the stairs are. I think the stairs are right here that go down. This is just a wall. So when I walk into this wall, then it kind of takes me there. Because I was going this way, and it showed me the stairs, and I went this way, and it showed me the stairs. It's a little, a little weird to, to get used to these controls of the way the camera angles are. And the fact that whenever it changes scenes, you're like going a different direction. Alright, I guess I gotta go back into that entry room. And then maybe walk upstairs that way. Yeah, I'm liking the feel of this game already, and I'm, like, what, five minutes in? Ten minutes in? Like it's fireplace, I like the... Oh, maybe I can search some stuff here. Will you take the emblem? Yeah, sure. From the status screen. Select an item, then select the examine command. Details of this item will be displayed from the status screen. Okay, where's the where's the status screen? Oh, I just I stole that off of the wall. There's an indentation where the emblem used to be. <laughs> Alright, how do I get to the status screen? status is in alright so it's like my heart rate here looks like everything's all a good go alright so do we select this and then how do we can't right click it oh there we go click on it examine it It's an emblem. I'm glad that I could examine that and realize that it's an emblem. Hey, Barbs. Ooh, some ice cream. Yeah, that's pretty good for my time zone, which is uh, 7 a.m. All right, I guess we're going to go out that uh, front door that we came in. Hey. Appreciate you. Where are we at here? Where's where's that door at? Man, this is this is oh man. Every time I like switch scenes there, it kind of like switch camera angles. I, I like wind up going walking backwards or something. It's a little hard to. Man, this is going to be difficult in the um, uh, in combat. Joe, appreciate you subscribing. Let's see. There we go. I think that was from earlier, though. And then um, the numbers kind of dropped, so I don't know if it like took it a minute to update, and then it updated, and then it didn't update. I don't know. But, uh, hey, appreciate you all. Anyway, better check this place out first. Okay, well. All right. What do I got to check out, man? Two have run each other through. The path to your destiny will open. Wow. A picture of two knights striking each other. The short sword has been thrust into the breast of one knight, while the long sword has pierced the head of the other. Wow. Didn't notice that in the uh, when I was just walking by earlier. That's a pretty creepy picture there that, that both knights are dying. <laughs> Barbsy. <laughs> yeah, getting that getting that ice cream there with some uh, some fingers. There you go. Alright, is there something else here? Alright, I don't want to go in that door. 
can I look at these uh, little banners here? Are they winders? Are they winders or are they banners? I think it's not accessible. I went there. Was there something else to look here? A large, filthy, crusted jar. Alright, guess, guess we got all of that taken care of. I think we got what we need. Do I do I need to take that emblem? Alright. I guess we're supposed to... Alright, so I maybe I'm supposed to use that emblem on the door? But I, I would think that I was supposed to get a key. The only movement is a silent flicker of the candles. Flame. This music is pretty darn cool. You know, this is gonna suck if I get f 10 minutes into this game and I get stuck with not knowing where I'm supposed to go. It's locked from the other side. It's locked. An emblem of armor is carved into the lock. Okay, I got it, man. Maybe I can go down in the basement now with this, uh, whatever I've got on me. locked. An emblem of a sword is carved. Huh. Alright, so what was the emblem? We had a shield. It's an emblem. Alright. Was it a shield or something? Alright, let's... So maybe I, I'm supposed to use this item. Alright. Not necessary to use this now. Alright. Hmm. I, I don't get it, man. Try the other door. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is there something here that I'm supposed to look at? No. Alright. It's boring when people get it on the first try. <laughs> yeah, but but it's it doesn't make for a great stream when I stand here for 10 minutes, keep trying the same doors, and then uh, I like, okay, well, sorry, I gotta go. <laughs> it's locked. Emblem of armor. All right, let's try this. Huh. Alright, buddy. Man. There's gotta be... I gotta be missing something, man. Because it's not letting me go out back out to the front room there. Man, when you come into this room and you hear that grandfather clock going tick tock, tick tock. Oh man. That is pretty cool. 
you got the the sounds of the thunderstorm. You got the fire. I mean, this is this is pure creepiness. All right. Well, we got that. I don't know of anything else that I'm missing here other than that typewriter. All right? Is there anything else that I missed there, chat? A locked door simulator. <laughs> Use the ink ribbon. Uh, I all right, I guess. I guess we're doing it. Wow, that's that's a waste of a ribbon. That's pretty that's a cool way to save the game. I have to admit that is pretty freaking cool on on a save game. So maybe I can't save the game unless if I use a ribbon. All right, hey Ray, you have a wonderful day. Appreciate you dropping in for a little bit. And uh man, it's got to let me go somewhere. Hmm. I don't I don't know where I'm supposed to go, man, if I can't open the freaking doors. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is this another door here? I can't quite get there. No, that's just a a wall there. When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. Alright, so maybe this has a clue here. Am I supposed to do something here with this picture? Hmm. What, Barbsy, you haven't played this <laughs> like 10 or 15 years ago? Huh. This is crazy. All right, so there's got to be something up here that I'm missing. Maybe I maybe I put this back or something. Maybe I wasn't supposed to take the emblem. There's an indentation where the emblem used to be. Alright, so I put it back. Hmm. Unless if... Was I supposed to use that... Let's go back to the picture here real quick without it. All right, maybe I'm supposed to use the You know, that's that's the only thing I can kind of pick up right now. So this has a key to something. Will you take the emblem? Alright, so... Alright, so I didn't use up that ink ribbon, so that's good. So maybe I need to use the emblem on this or something? Huh. 
Yeah, I, I really can't. It just says it's an emblem. Hmm. Alright. There's got to be something I'm missing somewhere. Wow. And this is like soaking up a lot of time here. Alright, so let's use this here. Put it back. I guess. Hmm. I, I would think that that has something to do with it because that's the only thing I can take. You know, and move or anything. Any ideas out there? Feel free. Like I said, I, I hate this part when I get lost here. There's nothing else really to look at in here. The only movement. Is a silent flicker. Hmm. It's gotta be. Maybe there's something in here. A large filth encrusted jar. Well, I can't really break the jar. There's another picture here that I haven't been able to look at. Not able to look out the window. That would be cool. See what the outside looks like. Uh huh. Well, let's take the emblem back off and see if we can. Will you take the emblem? Let's take that. Nothing there. Yeah, I'm at the very, very beginning. This is like the first room. You like walk in here, like, like down in this area. You like walk in. You see the typewriter, you see the candles, you see this picture, and you see this uh, fireplace with the emblem there. And that's it. Yeah, the painting, I, I thought the painting probably had something to do with it too. I mean, this has to have some sort of clue to it. Picture two knights striking each other. The short sword has been thrust into the breast of one knight, while the long sword has pierced the head of the other. So they're killing each other. And then when you come down here, then this says, when the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. So they're running each other through. So the pass should be open. Oh, maybe here. Let's try this. No, it's not necessary to use that now. <clears throat> what does files do? 
few files. What do we got? We don't have anything. Oh, the map. View a map. Yeah, so we walk in, we come in here, we go here. Um, wait a minute now. I went down this way. I didn't go this way. Dude, seriously, it's that simple. It is that simple. I just didn't turn left. <laughs> Dude, if I would have just checked the map, I would have seen that other door. Wow. The piano room. This way. Oh man, the 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 wallpaper peeling off of the wall. This has really got a cool look and feel to this game. Oh, oh, no, 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 dude, 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 serious. What is this? Oh. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, no, 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 don't. No. Dude. You are... How do I... How do I... How do I fight, man? Did he really just bite my neck? What the heck? How do I... What the frick? Come on, man. What the frick? I guess I have to run past him or something. Better report back to Wesker. Well, all right. Oh no, 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 man! Come on, freaking! Oh. <laughs> Get used to it. <laughs> That's a great Steam achievement. You are dead. Get used to it. Are you serious? Alright guys, that's it. The game's over. Glad that we could do that. No. Alright. <laughs> Let's go back to the typewriter. There we go. It took us a minute to figure that one out. I had to open up the map to realize that there was another door. In the darkness lies your fears. This is pretty darn cool. Alright, so I gotta go find this zombie, and I gotta run away from him. So you don't run past him, because then your back will be to him, I guess. I was trying to fight him. I was trying to use my knife, and it wouldn't let me attack the zombie for whatever reason. I don't understand it. All right, guys. Well, here we go. Man, this is creepy. You know, for 15 years ago, this is a pretty freaking scary look. All right. Do I just go on back? Oh, do I? Go get him. Go get him. <sighs> Go get him. Shove him to the ground. Shove him to the ground. Kick him in the knee. Alright, let's let's go. Let's go. Dude. Oh, I'm supposed to lure him into the dining room. Yeah, never played this game before. So 
So there's going to be a lot of people kind of helping me out. Alright, so it did let me go back to the uh, entrance hall. Wesker? Jill? Where did they go? Hmm. What is this? What is that? Oh yeah. Will you take a handgun? <laughs> really? You gotta ask that question? And, and should I equip that? Yeah, let's... Oh, wait a minute. Are you Barry? Um, my name is Chris uh, Redfield, I think. All right, so I th is this th that's probably not the front door. Man, there's a lot of doors here. What's behind door number one? Ooh, here's a downstairs too. There's a lot of stuff to look at. It's locked. An emblem of a helmet. Would that be a football helmet? Rugby helmet? Knight's helmet? I guess we're going down door number two. Whoa. This is dark and creepy. Portraits and photographs decorate the wall. It looks like they could come to life at any moment. Man, this music is great. Woman drawing water. Oh, I was, I don't think I picked up that emblem. So was I supposed to pick? Oh yeah, I do have that emblem. Okay. Swap an emblem somewhere. Oh, there's something in here. There's something in this jug here. Am I supposed to get closer? Don't be shy. Well, I guess I could use that, try to use that emblem on everything. It's not necessary to use this now, okay. I keep thinking I'm going to have to use that emblem on something. What's over here? A portrait hangs on the wall. It almost seemed like it's watching you. There was a really, really good old show, and it was called Ronald. It was called Bad Ronald. If you have not seen that movie, you gotta see it, man. It's like freaky scary. So there's this kid. He, he does something bad. He Everybody picks on him, you know, because that's what they do when they're kids. Oh! All right, I guess I guess we're going over here. All right. Whoa. That's pretty cool. 
So this kid named uh, Ronald lives with his mom because, you know, that's what kids do. So these kids pick on him. He pushes one kid. They kind of fall down, hit their head. They die. So then mom decides to hide him from the police. So she, like, takes one of the rooms in the house and kind of walls it up a little bit so that nobody really knows that that room is there. Yeah, bad Ronald there, Barbsy. <laughs> you got to check out that movie. The only thing else that I'm going to say about that is after that kid's in there, mom kind of feeds him from time to time. Mom passes away. I'll leave the rest to you. <laughs> all right. But yeah, one of my favorite horror flicks of all time whatever kind of flick it is it's kind of kind of creepy whoa whoa this is like weird angles this is like really difficult to kind of check into there's nothing of use here well then why did I come into this room there's got to be something I can use Oh, I'm going into another room. Oh, wow. I think maybe like a, a little sparkle means it's something I can interact with like right there so I can get there will you take the dagger that dagger looks pretty darn cool man use it in defensive items such as daggers will allow you to escape momentarily when grabbed by an enemy however you will not be able to escape when the enemy grabs you from behind To equip a defensive item, go to the status screen, select an item from the defensive item menu, then select the equip command. If your defensive item mode is set to manual in the controller settings, you must press E to use the defensive item. Okay. I thought I picked it up. Oh, okay, it's it's already equipped. It automatically equipped it. All right, so let's exit that. So if I use E, it's not letting me. Maybe maybe something has to be there. I don't know, don't see anything else flash in here. Uh oh. Dude, seriously. Oh, that didn't work out too well. I should have ran. How do I get my... Okay, alright, let's go. Alright, let's go. An eerie picture of the mansion. Oh, I gotta go this way. Did it, did it die? I want my knife back, man. I want that dagger back. I've used like a lot of... How do I get out of this? I'm like holding my gut. Yeah, but... 
I would I would love to be able to use it multiple times. All right, so I guess the little flashy thing just means that it's something I can look at. All right, I guess I'm going in this door. It's locked. Emblem of a sword is carved into the lock. All right, well... Huh. Hey, Lee. Sorry, I didn't see you come in. Don't scare myself. Yeah. I gotta keep an eye here. Alright, so I'm still looking for my friends. Uh, was there anything else that we can look at in here? You know what? We can go down this uh, downstairs here. I've used an awful lot of bullets trying to get through that dude there. Yeah, I used like four bullets, man. Now, I don't understand why I can't use my survival knife. Ooh, my health. Caution. That's not too cool, is it? Oh, here's the elevator. That's cool. Thunderstorm, of course. Hmm. Yeah, I like these uh, doors in the scene trench. Wow. How did I get? Oh, I guess I, I guess I must have just walked all the way back around. I didn't realize I had walked all the way around there. Oh, I know what I did. Okay. So this just goes down and around there. I had to have missed something. That wouldn't be there without some purpose. So you go down here... Is it just the elevator, I guess? Uh-oh. Dude, that is not sounding right. Hmm. Wonder what's on the other side of this door. There are octagonal indentations to the right and the left of the door. Alright, I guess it's not wanting me to go in there. That's not the elevator. That's just an iron-ish door. Alright, I guess we're going upstairs. Next trip, upstairs. Dude, I'm I'm like limping, man. What's what's up here? Let's check out this picture here. Wait a minute, which What do we got? Oh, it's a door. I thought it was a picture. Whoa. What's that sound? What is that sound? What is it? This is like outside. Dude, I don't know if I really want to go outside right now. It's like all dark and stuff out there. Do I want to go outside? Do I want to go outside? What's outside? Is there more stairs down here? Is this like a graveyard? Dude, sir. Oh, no. No, no, no. The wolves? You got the wolves of Midgard? What's what's going on, man? Is 
like a freaking graveyard. I, I don't know if I want to go in it. No, 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 man. We're, we're, we're checking out of this one. I gotta go find my friends first. Look at that rusty door. That is so cool looking. Alright, let's go on upstairs, see if we can find our friends. Hey, friends. Friends. Hello. Friends. Hello. Anybody here? I will go down. We'll try this door first. We'll see. Is there anything up here? Whoa, man. This place goes on forever. This is big. This is like 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 a mansion. <laughs> All right, let's go this way. There you go. The sound of death. It's locked from the other side. Man, I keep getting that. It's locked from the other side. Welcome to the other side. All right, we can open this door. Why am I hearing footsteps and I'm not moving anywhere? Oh, dude. No way. Dude. What am I hearing? Oh, dude. Seriously. Come on, man. Oh, here's another knife. Here's another knife. All right. Dagger, 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 dagger. Grab it. Grab it, man. Will I take it? Oh, you better believe it, buddy. All right. Dude. Dude. Back up. Alright, stay down. Freaking. You still down? Dude! Do not tell me you just, like, got back up. Dude, seriously, stay down! The frick? You gonna stay down this time? Or we gotta go through this again? Alright. He stayed down. It's locked. An emblem of a sword. Alright, I've seen that emblem of a sword a couple of times now. It's locked. From the other side. Alright, got it. A stained glass window. The pattern in the center resembles a woman. It resembles a woman? Can I look over the ledge there? No. Anything here? No. there no all right so let's go here and see what we got there's got to be you would think there'd be something here with this this statue lady holding this blue gem thing yeah there's got to be something with this statue Guess not. Alright, so I do have a dagger. That's good. And it did take me... Oh my gosh. I've shot off ten rounds. That's insane. Shot off ten rounds and I think I only killed one because the other one was still alive. I guess I have to shoot him a couple of times. Takes a lot of shots to kill them zombies. Huh. Alright, let's try... Where's the map at? Controls. Map is M. 
Well, that makes sense. Alright, here's where I am. Here's the stairwells and a doorway there. So I went in there. Those were locked. This is locked. I think these are probably locked there. But let's... I haven't been over here yet to even see if they're locked or not. Go ahead and try it. It's locked. Emblem of a sword, alright. Hmm. Push the statue off the balcony. Oh, can I push things? That's cool. It's locked. Emblem of armor. Let's go check out this painting here. An oil painting in a large frame. The paint is dried. Really? You know, I'm in this mansion, and it's like a 150-year-old mansion. And there's a painting on the wall, and I would expect the paint to still be wet. <laughs> Alright, so let's go down here. Whoa, hey, wow, look at that. My reflection in the glass... That is pretty darn cool, because, I mean, remember, this is like 15 years ago. Now, this is uh, some sort of a remaster, so... No, 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 I keep saying 15 years ago. Dude, that's like 25 years ago. 25 years ago this game came out. So it's about... Uh, tw I can't remember when this remaster was. An oil painting in a large frame... It's been well preserved, and the people in it are still vividly depicted. Okay, all right. So they're they're making a difference between a painting that has no upkeep and a painting that has uh, been maintained or something. All right. So you think that we can push this statue off? We'll try it. So this is the same room down there with the uh, dining room area, because I can hear that clock. Can't. Hmm. Uh, controls. How do I push something? Attack, reload, examine. Change defensive map status. Move up, move down, move right. Run. Shift aim. Hmm. Is there a broken part off the balcony? Hmm. Right here. Right here. Okay. There we go. Dude, there we go. Got it. Got it. Oh, I just have to keep going that direction for a minute. Oops. Are you ready for this? Thank you so much. Oh, for crying out loud. I gotta change that in Streamlabs. It's not letting you guys chat. That's no fun. Whoa. Now I broke it. So maybe I'm able to get that gem now from the broken statue when I go downstairs. 
Oh, I'm hearing music. That's creepy music. Hey, zombie, what's up? Can't believe I wasted all my bullets on you and I'm still not feeling so hot. Yeah, I'm gonna open up, uh, I'll, I'll make those changes in the settings here. Um, I got about 15 more minutes. Let me open this up real quick and then see if we can make that change. Um, in the... Something with uh, like like general settings here, I think. Oh, you know what? I'll uh, I'll do that some other time. I just I want you to be able to chat, man. I mean, this is like kind of bogus that uh, <laughs> you know because it it happened earlier. All right, can I go this direction? Something no, no. But I can I can keep walking like I'm I'm moonwalking there forward there. All right. Um, maybe go downstairs and see what that. Where's that? How do I go downstairs? Oh man, isn't that the way to go downstairs? There we go. Yeah, these camera angles are a little strange sometimes. Alright, now we go this way, I think. Is there something to look at in this picture here? No. I gotta stop limping so much, man. I shouldn't have gotten killed by the zombie. Or, uh... uh Injured. Injured so much, I guess I should say. Alright, let's see what we can find here. There it is. There it is. Will I take a blue gemstone? You better believe it, man. else look at here? Huh. Alright. So I must be missing some rooms somewhere. Just do anything still? Nope. 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 Alright. Nothing. Alright, so the normal playthrough of this game is like an hour and a half. It's going to take me like 20 hours. <laughs> I just enjoy games. Kind of check everything out. Like walk around, I'm like, oh, look at that face. Oh, look at this cobweb up here. This is great, you know. <laughs> and other people just kind of like plays right through and they're like, okay, I'm done. <laughs> Alright, was there something here... Chinese urn. Alright, what's over here? Is it a a matching Chinese urn? I don't think I want to go out the front door. So am I missing something here? So I thought I'd checked out all the rooms upstairs. 
go to the piano room and find the clock. Alright, but I don't know where the piano room would be. This is where I am. So I can go in this room. Oh, go around the corner here maybe? Let's go back down this way. Colonel Butler did it with the mustard. In the piano room. With a spoon. Stabbed him with a spoon. Oh, no, no, no. This is our where our zombie was. This is in the piano room. Find the clock. Alright, so yeah, I went in this room, I went around the corner, and there was a zombie there. Alright, so I guess, do I, I just killed oh, said zombie here? Alright, dude. You know... Why don't you... Come on, man. Why don't you freaking die? Now you done gone and made me use all my stuff. There's something in the statue. Yeah, I tried to do some. Oh, maybe I pushed that over too. All right, maybe we push this guy. Now I think the uh, flashing thing just kind of tells you that there's something to... Portraits and photographs decorate the wall. Dude, I unloaded five bullets on this dude, plus I'd done I think like three or four earlier. This freaking door's locked too. There's something here. the piano room or maybe I can walk back through here now that uh, said zombie is no longer here various art supplies see it looks like you can go f around this room somehow if I'm doing something here. Alright, well, we've now managed to kill two zombies, so that's a starting point, I guess. Oh, we're going this way. Wait a minute. Is there something else to look at here? An eerie picture of the mansion. No, can't cut it up. <laughs> get my not my dagger back that's crazy all right so if I push this here oh sweet there's a map of the mansion take it oh yeah There we go.
that helps. That helps. I see a little bit where I'm going. Alright, so if I go up here, there's like another stairwell or something. Maybe that was downstairs. Don't get how we get there. Alright. You've got the map. There we go. I feel like Dora the Explorer now. We've got the map. Good, good, good. All right. Well, I'm learning the basics and the mechanics of the game because I'm, like I said, I'm 25 years behind everybody else in the world because uh, this is one of those things, kind of like uh, working at McDonald's. Almost everybody's done it except for me. All right. Well, guys, I would love to be able to find my friends. I, I, I guess maybe that's the... Um, the quest or the goal of the majority of this is trying to find your friends. Should I go in here or what? I tried before. I'm not hearing the screaming whatever. Yeah, there's there's nothing else to do here. That's kind of strange. Alright, when I go this direction, that is the uh, dining room. That's the dining room there. And then I can kind of go off into here. This door is locked. As I go upstairs, I think most of those doors are locked. Plus, if there's something, some way to get... This is a doorway. It did... You know, when you're coming up the stairs, it looks like it's a painting. And then whenever you get here, it's a doorway. Where would you keep a piano room? A piano room would be outside. All right, Barbsy, you want me to go to a piano. Normally, the piano would be downstairs. You would think it would be right off, you know, so here's your um, dining area. So you would think that this would be like a little parlor area here. Normally. Right when you first come in. And that would be... Where piano is. Unless I just like walked totally around it. That's what I would think. Oh, wait a minute. Is there a hallway to go around this? I totally missed that, didn't I? No, no, no. That goes down into that other... Uh, uh, you go down those stairs. And then that was a locked door. I couldn't get into that. So if I were to look at this map here, I would say, I mean, under normal circumstances, it'd be opposite the dining, but here it would have to be in this room. Let's see. Oh, you know what? When we come through here, we never, we never finished this room here, did we? We just ran away from that uh, uh, zombie. Let's go back to that area real quick. Let's go back to that area. Then we'll have to call it. And if uh, something bad happens, then I've got a little bit better idea of the game. We can go back to the original save. Which is before all of this, I believe. Hey, appreciate all the likes there. Appreciate everybody uh, joining in the chat and, and uh, joining in on the stream here. All right. I wish I could run. Oh, there we go. There we go. We're running. 
We're running and jumping. Yeah, it took me a long time to figure out that there was a left turn here. Every time I, I think of a uh, left turn, right turn, and everything, I think about uh, every which way but loose. And Clint Eastwood and his little orangutan friend, he says, left turn, Clyde, right turn, Clyde, and punches somebody. Oh, jeez. Here we are again. Dude. Where is this zombie guy? Oh, yeah, that's right. I couldn't go in this. Oh, it was saying locked earlier, I thought. Well, maybe it was just because I was fighting the zombie. Dude, this room is creepy already. It is so eerily quiet compared to the other rooms. There's like nothing going on. Except my steps. Is that a zombie up there? Oh man, that's like shadows of trees coming through the windows. There's like no sounds at all. Oh, are we going to walk all the way around this kind of downstairs-ish area? Huh. Oh, was there... Stairs there that I totally missed. Hmm. Oh, I didn't even get a chance to check my hair in the mirror. Man. Bird cage. Oh, seriously? Am I supposed to be checking you? There's a corpse collapsed on the floor. Like it was an instant death. What the hell happened in this mansion? I'm liking the sounds. I didn't get a chance to check the uh, plants there. I should have been using the knife all along, saving bullets, man. What's over here? Anything? Can I go this way? Let's try going this way. Alright, last room, then I gotta go, guys. Appreciate y'all watching. Ooh, we got... Oh, man, I'm hearing footsteps. Oh, seriously, dude. I see him in the mirror. What the frick? Oh. There's an inscription on the shield. Death is only the beginning. Dude, man, this is creepy stuff. Oh, this is like really attic, cobweb, creepy stuff. All right, before we go in there, let's go back. Let's see about this uh, zombie dude. <laughs> You're keeping me up. All right. Yeah, all right. Well, I'm going to grab this. Oh. Wait a minute. I get some... Take some herbs. Yeah, of course, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's take some more herbs. I can't carry any more. Alright, no problem. No problem. Let's see if we can go here. Let's 
going this way. Yeah, dude. Oh, there's more of them. Are... Did you seriously just take my dagger? I wasn't using the dagger. Oh, that's me in the mirror. <laughs> oh, so this is another room over here. Oh, no, this is this room. So that's a different mirror. Alright, guys. Well, this looks like a pretty decent place to stop. We'll go back into this room here. We'll go back over here. Um, and we'll kind of stop here. I don't know if it's going to save my progress here whenever I, I end. If not, we'll go back to that first save there. So we're, we're kind of out here in the hallway. We'll leave it at this. I appreciate you all. Uh, yeah, we got some green herbs. So, hey, I appreciate you all watching. And uh, you guys have a wonderful day. We'll uh, continue this. Uh, if I can get back early enough, we'll continue this this afternoon. Otherwise, we'll do it again tomorrow morning. All right. Appreciate you all so much. There is no save option. All right. Well, we might be going back to that beginning. No big deal. Again, thank you all very much, man.